guys, it's AJ here, and yes, I've been gone for yet another month. And I'm really sorry about that, but I had yet another computer issue. My startup disk was full, but that's fixed, and I'm back. So since I'm back, I decided let's do a little unboxing from Amazon. So yeah, today, I mean, well, the other day I ordered a package, um, and I know what's inside of it, but let's show you guys. Alright, so I ordered Cloverfield and 10 Cloverfield Lane on bo uh, both on Blu-ray. Um, now, I am a huge Cloverfield fan, um, and for a long time I've been trying to investigate it and analyze like the connection between the both mo uh, both movies and like you know the backstory have like with all the m marketing campaigns and stuff so i decided that for you guys i'm going to finally dis uh create my theory on what i think the connection between these two movies are because if you don't know 10 Cloverfield Lane isn't really a sequel to Cloverfield it's more of a, a loose blood relative um but I'm going to make a series of connections and analyzations videos, and it's not going to start right away, but very soon I'm going to start that series, and I decided that to do so, I would have to have both on Blu-ray so that I can analyze it the proper way and take notes so that whenever I can uh, want to watch it, I can watch it and I can figure out what I want to figure out. So let's open them. This is not going to be fun. This one's opened. And if you have not seen Cloverfield or 10 Cloverfield Lane, I highly advise you that you, that you check them out and read about them and find uh, all the crazy marketing campaign stuff like Targuato and Slusha. You probably have no idea what I'm saying if you haven't seen the movies. Um, shit. I don't know if it's going to work. Uh, your lightsaber. Uh, oh, this here the bigger the better. Yeah, this doesn't seem to work. Fuck. Why do they have to wrap these so much? And I did it! Finally, fuck. Whoever packs these Blu-rays, stop packing them so much. Jeez. Alright. So as you can see, uh, using that Star Theater lightsaber, I broke into the box. But anyway... Uh, I can't show you, but I have the, uh, digital copy and the, uh, discs right here, Blu-ray and DVD, and, uh, joke's on me, this 10 Cloverfield Lane actually comes with the download for Cloverfield 2, um, and here you have Cloverfield. And it's just the disc, because this is from 2008, so it's a really long time ago before they started doing, like, combo packs and stuff. So anyway, yeah, that was the unboxing for today. Cloverfield and 10 Cloverfield Lane. Look forward to uh, my analyzation series of these two films. And, yeah, I'm back. I'm going to do some more movie reviews, some more vlogs, some more wrestling analyzations, some more wrestling predictions, uh, and stuff like that. And, uh... I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think of uh, Cloverfield and 10 Cloverfield Lane. Uh, you know the gist. Please like this video, leave a comment, share it on all social media platforms, and as always, subscribe for more.